if the vector in the direction of a is given by the values root 8 negative 5 and 4 that we should find the length of the vector a now what i'm going to do here to find the length of a the length of a will simply be equal to the square root of the, the sum of the squares of these three values. So that's what we're going to do. do. We're going to take the square root of the sum of the squares. So the first term here is root 8. We have to square it. And then plus the second term is negative 5. We have to square it as well. And then finally, the third term there is 4. We also have to square it. So that is how to get the length of the vector A. And then now we simplify. So we take the square root. And then the square root of 8 square will simply give us 8. So we remove the square root sign. So root 8 square will simply give us 8. Don't forget that. Once you are squaring a value in the square root sign, you simply take the value in that root sign and the root sign disappears along with the square. So this is 8. The square, the square of root 8 is 8. And then plus the square of negative 5 we give 25. And then plus the square of 4 we give us 16. So we are left with the square root of 8 plus 25 is 33. 33 plus 16 is 49. And then the square root of 49 will finally give us the length of A as equal to 7 units. So this is the final answer. So please subscribe to this channel so that you can get more interesting videos like this. Thank you.